In today's video, we're going to look at how promotion to League One has caused prices to rise for Wrexham FC fans. Nobody can deny that the back-to-back -back promotions are fantastic and something we've waited for at the club for a very long time. Everybody is appreciative of Ryan and Rob, but is their team beginning to forget that Wrexham is a working-class town with working-class wages? Prices have been steadily rising for some time now. Yes, there is inflation, the cost of rising up the league is inevitable, but is someone raising that price just a little too high? Football shirts, the Wrexham FC fan zone, even streaming a Rex Coast match is all optional, it could be argued, but for a fan of a football team, it really is not that simple. A fan will buy match tickets, they will buy merch, and they will stream games they cannot attend. Fans were disappointed when the football shirts went up in value this week, but the true extent of that rise is now becoming apparent. A Wrexham football kit for a child aged 3 upwards starts at £85. Fellow League One club, Birmingham City, charges £55 for shirt, socks and shorts. Championship side Blackburn Rovers charge £37 less for a full kit for a 5-6 to six year old. Bolton Wanderers and other teams similarly £40 cheaper for a full kit for a 5-6 to six year old. When we watch Welcome to Wrexham, emphasis is placed on a working class town, but the club is not charging working class prices. This cannot be blamed on promotion and success, as teams in leagues above us are cheaper. Liverpool FC charge £52 for their kids kit. To rub salt in the festering wounds, the club has announced they are going to charge £10 for Wrexham based fans to watch Wrexham's Rex Coast game against Bournemouth. You might think this is reasonable until you see that their opposition is charging their fans just £5, a whole 50% less for the game. Why will Wrexham fans buy the pass from the official Wrexham site when they can purchase one for cheaper simply by registering a free account with Bournemouth FC? Of course, we then have the new fan zone, which priced at £10 will be undercut by the Turf Pub and the Mysgwyn Hall, both offering free admission for similar entertainment. Many fans are accusing the club of no longer treating them as fans, but as cash cows. It is hard to find fault with their comments when children's football kits are marked 50% higher, and so are passes to watch Wrexham's Rex Coast tour. I fully understand the club's desire to make money and become a self-sustaining entity. We already have a large financial debt owed to Ryan and Rob. But there are other ways to achieve this. Hitting fans in the pocket is not one of them. As well as the documentary, other advertising, sponsorships, business ventures and other media subscription platforms could be explored. As always, let me know your opinions. Thanks for watching and have a great day.